the 740E is fed in part by the same 2.0-liter turbocharged four-cylinder gasoline offered in another BMW, with the help of an electric motor. It is notable for being the first four-cylinder in the 7 Series for the American market. Other markets soon get a 730i with a gasoline engine 2.0-liter turbo. While putting a small engine of its kind in the large sedan 7 Series does not sound like it would work well, this propulsion system actually offers surprisingly good performance. Credit Turbocharger and Electrification the gasoline engine only produces 255 horsepower by itself, but the electric motor can add 111 horsepower. Maximum total system output is 322 horsepower at 4,600 revolutions per minute, while maximum torque is 369 foot-pounds and is available from 1250 to 4,600 revolutions per minute. That's enough for a sprint from 0 to 60 miles per hour in about 5.2 seconds in a top speed of 155 miles per hour power comes quietly and is channeled through X drive for wheel drive through the Origin ZF8 speed automatic familiar, gear changes are buttery smooth, and there is always found traction even on wet surfaces. The hybrid propulsion system can switch between different modes, including EV only, pending the battery which saves juice when the driver needs it, battery charge, hybrid normal operation. The car also offers a sport mode, which sharpens the throttle response, as well as the chassis, something that the other modes do not affect. On the way to the charging of the 740E battery, drivers can select the level of would load the car to arrive, for example, 70%, and the engine recharges at that level before switching to standby battery. With a full load and an EV mode, the 740E can go up to 28 miles on electricity alone, BMW says. What more could you ask for? Well it depends on what is expected of a BMW. The 740E is a competent machine in carrying out the tasks entrusted to them without complaint, e-transport up to 5. Win the right foot mark. On the other hand, they're confused their engine other than the 4-cylinder is nothing. Although good performance at low revs, does not sound good, its phonetic character a kind of dull hum when it leaves the tachometer. It's never loud or intrusive, but not even come close to providing the smoothness and refinement of inline six-cylinder BMW traditional motors. And as you build the highway speed, and beyond, the electrical impulse will team, and just move the huge car with a small engine. In fact, the 740E is the heaviest of the BMW 7 Series ago. You will notice that the weight especially when the EV mode is chosen. This is a decision that cannot be taken lightly, zing, once amounts to an exercise in asceticism that the long line of cars stuck behind you probably will not appreciate. Acceleration is slow at best, and the internal combustion engine turns at 87 miles per hour. A speed that can be sustained for only a few minutes in the EV mode anyway, 